Hi everyone, welcome to my video. My name is the Terabyte and today I'm going to be talking about this curling iron here, which is stuck. There we go. This is the T3 single pass curling iron. And just a quick disclaimer before I curl my hair with this. Um, first off, this was a gift from T3. So they did give me this curling iron for free, which I was super grateful for. I've always seen T3 at like Ulta and have always wanted one, but have never been able to afford it because they are quite expensive. Um, but they did give it to me for free. Uh, that being said, the curling iron I used to use is this curling iron right here. I got this off of Amazon. It is the Common Air. Uh, it is like the, I think it's just the, the basic Con Air curling iron. I think it was like $10. And this is the curling iron I would use every single day to curl my hair. Um, so I'm going from literally the cheapest, most common curling iron ever to a very expensive, fancy curling iron. So um, I've never had a very expensive or fancy curling iron until this one. Um, so I am very impressed. So my opinion might be a little biased coming from the cheapest curling iron you can possibly buy to this super fancy one. <laughs> so I'm really sorry um, if uh, if you're watching this and yeah, and you're like, wow, she's saying a lot of good things about it. Um, yeah, I did come from the very, like the absolute cheapest curling iron you could buy. But I am going to curl my hair with this and kind of show you. Uh, and yeah, I guess I don't need this curling iron anymore. I'm gonna set that over there. So first off, before I, um, oops, I got my hair clips over here. But before I do that, I just want to show you the curling iron up close. So here's the curling iron. It's very simple, like so simple, actually. Uh, surprisingly, um, I actually don't know if I understand all the features very well. So it does come up like this. And then I believe this is the power. So you just kind of turn it like this. And then this is the, um, whoops, I keep getting it stuck on my desk. I'm sorry. Um, and then this will tell you kind of like the temperature. Sorry, my nails are like pretty ugly right now because they chipped. And so I just painted over my chipped nails. <laughs> so they're like, they're not looking too good. Um, and then this is just showing that it's heating up. It's so simple. Like it's, it's so, so simple. It's mind blowing to me. I actually don't know how to turn it off, to be honest. Um, I usually I just unplug it from the wall because uh, it's so simple. I can't figure out how to turn it off. <laughs> but it's a really nice curling iron um, compared to my last one, which had like different temperatures on here an on off button, like a, a turbo mode and yeah, all this stuff. Um, this one's just very fancy and simple. Um, I'm going to start with, let's see here. I should brush my hair. I actually have a T3 hairbrush too, but uh, I haven't unpacked all of my stuff yet from my trip. And I don't know, I don't know where it's at. So I need to find it. But, oh, it is heating up quite fast. I can already smell that it is heated up. It's weird that I can smell that. Oh, it's hot. Okay, that is, that's not good. That's way too hot for my hair. I'm going to turn it on to level, my hair is really thin, so I'm going to put it on like level one, actually. That is like way hot. Um, yeah, I don't, I don't usually do it too warm because I have extremely thin hair. Like, everyone's like, when I go to hairstylists, they're weirded out by my hair because they're like, your hair is so thin, but you just have so much. And then, I agree. <laughs> It is very thin and I just have a lot of hair. So, um, yes, let me just part it in half real fast. It's gonna go from, yeah, let's go from here. You can kind of see my, my, my ears. Okay. I am like bruising so easy. It's kind of worrying me a little. I've caught like a bruise right here. I have a bruise on my face and my legs are covered in bruises, so. I think I need to figure out what my body is lacking in nutrients and then eat a lot of it. <laughs> okay, I'm just going to twist this up and then pin it with this. Boop. And let's start. 
My makeup is a little light today. I put on powder. I never put powder on, but I put powder on today and uh, it's making me glow. I also have like, um, I really love uh, videography and cinematography. So my camera is kind of like a little faded. I like that faded look. I also have a uh, blue, what is it? Blue shadows and yellow highlights to give it like that kind of vintage movie look. So if my camera looks a little weird, or maybe if you do like the look of it, I achieved it by <laughs> adding a little, uh, adjusting the curves a little bit, and then uh, adding a, you know, little blue tones. Ow, hurt myself. Adding a little bit of blue tones to the shadows and yellows to the highlights. Okay, I'm just gonna, it is called the single pass. I'm just gonna let it sit for a second, not too, too long. I want kind of a mild, little wave. Ooh. Ah, that was not what I planned. Ooh, cute little curl. So my hair likes to be pretty much straight. Um, it's kind of wavy right now because I washed my hair before bed last night and I always braid my hair when I sleep. Always. Like, I can't sleep unless my hair is braided. So, um, I braided my hair and it was wet. So when I woke up, it kind of was pretty wavy. So you can kind of see this curl right here. Let me back up a little bit. Move my shirt a little. It is nice how fast it works. This is how I usually do my curls. Um, I cannot figure out how to do curls with the um, with straighteners. Can't figure it out. It's beyond me. But Let's drop this. Oops, I am failing at this today. Oop. Okay. I forgot I have this bottom screen on. I guess I can turn it off and go to this screen. So I'm using my computer right now as like a mirror to see what I'm doing. So I keep looking. If I'm looking off this way, it's because I'm looking at my monitor screen. Um, I'm just gonna, gonna roll this curl up and clip it until it cools a little. Um, just because I want that one to be more maintained. Okay, and then let me... This is a really... Actually, that's too small, I think. Cut it in half like this. Grab this one. Brush it. And... Give it a twist. I feel like the bad thing about washing your hair at night and then sleeping with it wet while it's braided, actually just fully sleeping with it wet in general, is I feel like it looks a little more oily when I wake up in the morning. Like, my hair just seems oily. Even though it's not, it just looks kind of oily. It's weird. Um, I usually wash my hair in the morning, but I was so exhausted. I didn't wash my hair. I don't think I even showered yesterday until nighttime, so I like went the whole day without showering. And then at night I was like, okay, I gotta wash. Okay, let's see. And then let me unclip this one. Not that I need to unclip it, I could just let it sit there. Yeah, look at oh wait, let me flip it a little more. Yes, I love it. Oh, I gotta flip it a little more. Okay. And let me just rest that one on my shoulder. I'm just kind of doing a quick one because these Amazon videos can't be too long. Uh, they don't like them to be very, very, very long. So I'm trying to make it as quick as possible so you guys can kind of just see how this works. And... And then yeah, and then yeah, and then just yeah. I don't know what else to say. Make it as fast as possible. I don't need perfect hair today. I am gonna be home all day. I am gonna be making more videos, but um, I'm gonna be making more videos in the comfort of my own home. So it's not too important to me uh, to have perfect hair. And I'm gonna grab this. Clip it. So 
sometimes, uh, like I did with this one, I like keep it rolled up and then I'll just let it uh, cool on my shoulder. Okay. I don't know why I keep making sound effects. Ooh, I got a lot of hair. Okay, let's just brush it. I'm seeing if I can get this video. I, I'm gonna challenge myself to see if I can curl all of my hair in 20 minutes. What are we at right now? 10 minutes, holy cow, okay. So we're halfway there already. This is already a 10 minute video. Sorry, you guys. I didn't mean for it to be so long. You can skip, skip ahead to the end. You can see what my hair looks like when it's done with its slightly oily look from sleeping with it wet. Whoa, that is a big piece of hair, so I will probably leave it on a little bit longer with this one. Ooh. Um, and then we'll just put it in here. Just let it sit. Just let it hang out. I always do the front last because it is my favorite part. Um, I feel like I don't care how the rest of my hair looks. As long as these front curls look good, I feel like my hair looks good. If the front curls look bad or they drop, uh, my hair doesn't like to stay curled. So, especially here, I live in South Korea and it's very humid. So usually as soon as I go outside, my hair is just completely straight again. No matter how much mousse I use, hairspray, it, it doesn't matter. Hairspray I usually don't like to use only because the hold will only last like... The hold likes to last like, I want to say like maybe an hour max. And then once it... Once it fades, then my hair's just like, let's get tangled. And I'm like, oh man, let's not. <laughs> so then I just have like super tangled hair and I'm like brushing through it, ripping my hair out. I will, I'm not ripping my hair out. I'm gentle with it, but it'd be a pain though. It'd just, it'd just be a pain. So let's cut this like in half like that. And brush here. It's kind of like that. I've got to do my hair again. My skin is looking a little bad lately too, so... And, um, yeah, just so you guys remember, this is at only, like, the first degree on here. So it's, uh... It, it's not even like burning my scalp off or anything. It's just on the first degree, hanging out. Yeah, this part definitely looks oily. I should put some dry shampoo in before I started this, but it'll be fine. My hair doesn't look frizzy, which is nice. Kind of. <laughs> it kind of doesn't look frizzy. Okay, let's drop it. What is our time at? 13 minutes. I got seven minutes. Can I do this? I don't know. Okay, let's uh. La -ha -ha. Mm -hmm. Read. Okay, uh, uh, what do I do? I'm trying to clip it so that it can cool in that curl. Hopefully, I got it. I think I did get it. Okay, I'm gonna leave this front part down, and I'm gonna work on the other side. I forgot that this one is still clipped, so I'm just gonna let that bad boy go. You are free! Don't know why Harry Potter theme song is randomly stuck in my head. <laughs> okay, perfecto. I'm just getting big chunks of hair. Like, it's probably counterproductive to do bigger pieces because they take longer to curl. And my goal is to try and make this under 20 minutes. So, this back one is cool. Ow. 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 So, uh, it has... Ah! There we go. Whoop. It has formed with the other curl. They're brothers now. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah! Oh my 
my gosh, what a beautiful curl. I love it. Okay. Um, let's let this one go. Yeah, I'm still kind of shocked that the temperature is only on one. Like I said, I do have really thin hair, so I'm just, I just try to be very careful with my hair. I don't want to fry it. I know a lot of people have like really thick hair, and so you need it like really high in order to curl your hair. But yeah, my, uh, my thin hair is curling just fine with just the first temperature, which is really nice. It is quite warm too. Okay. Wait, are we at 17 minutes or 15? Ooh, 15 minutes. I think I got this. Easy. Okay, I'm gonna unclip this one now. Ooh. A little curl. Anya Haseyo curl. Okay. I really like the curl. It's cute. Um. This has to, I think it has to heat up a little more. Okay, let's drop it. Whoop. Okay. And then I'm going to twist it around him and clip it. Go clip it real good. Okay, there we go. Um, then I'm going to go back to this side and let's curl this side. This one I don't like to go very high on. I like to have this part to be a little straight. So I'll go kind of like this part here. Just kind of wave it around. And spin it around him. Okay. And then I keep it there. The bottom curls are already falling apart. I guess hairspray does help a bit. It does help a bit. But if it falls, which it will, because humidity and in Korea and my hair doesn't like to curl, um, I think it'll still have a pretty, like, I think even if you curl your hair and it, like, drops a little, I think it still looks really cute. Just having waves to it. Or at least for me, because my hair's naturally straight. So I'm like, ooh, waves. Okay, this one I'm just going to drop. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Last but not least, the front part, which is my favorite curl. I'm actually going to drop these other two. Let's drop this one. Drop this one. Ooh. Pull it around town. I'm going to pull it up a little. And then I'm going to work on this front curl. Got some little baby hairs. Okay. I don't like this. I'm gonna brush a little more. There we go. Okay, so I usually take this front one like this and wrap it around like this. Ooh, and hold it like so. This hair needs a little curl to it. And I'm probably going to hold this front one the longest just because it is my favorite curl. I feel like it shapes my face fairly well. And this side, I should brush it here. This side, I do need to curl that piece right here. A little straggler. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. Let's drop it. I'm gonna clip it and let it hold. Hopefully it doesn't leave any kinks. But we'll, we'll find out. Sometimes it does. All these little baby hairs around my, around my face. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 
give it a little curl. Okay, I'm gonna unclip it and just hold it. Just because I'm worried it will leave kind of like a kink in my hair. Yeah, this part is a little oily actually. I should have dry shampooed it. Still can. And just do a hair flip. Separate it a bit. gonna do its own thing there we go and for the last piece whoop, oops i think i goofed up I messed up. Oh, this still has some of my waves from uh, braiding it. I like it to go like this and then curl like so, but it's doing it weird. I goofed up. I goofed up somewhere. Let me put this here. Okay, this is way over 20 minutes. I'm so sorry. I gotta do one more run through on this one. Ooh, it is making my room super hot. Hopefully this time I get it. Ooh, I have my computer in this room and there's no air conditioning in this room. That was a mistake. I shouldn't have put my computer in the only room in the house without an air conditioning. Let's see. Kind of like, the, yeah, oh, wait, wait, oh, it's okay, it's still being weird, but kind of like this is how I like my front curl to look, but not how it splits like that. If I pull it down just a little like this, kind of like that, still being a little weird. What if I, oh, yes, this is perfect, okay. And gently brush these top hairs down. Yes, this is exactly how I like it. Just like this. So you can see the kink right here from when I clipped it to hold it up. So I'll probably do one more run through with this one. But I will do it off camera. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you have any questions, like specific questions about any of the beauty products or anything I use, um, you can find me on Amazon. I do a bunch of videos for other things, so I am around. And, uh, I stream here as well, so if I'm ever live and you have questions, come hang out and ask me anything. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys have a wonderful day. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope to see you next time. Goodbye!